All right, Area 27, this is TNT. We have 30 minutes to plant all the TNT we can find into the mutant glass chambers. So we'll go out here and get rid of these two friggin' officers. And we'll wind this up and just let them have it. And we can get the guys in the distance. Sometimes there's like one left over like that. All right. Get rid of these two guys. Open this up, get rid of him, and these two friggin' clowns. Okay. Find a little chain gunner in here. And we may want to reload this. We'll have an SS on this side, like that. And then another little chain gunner. No, I don't want to use that. Blow that up to get rid of the guy off to the right. Um, yeah, we should use that. So we picked up the moss key, and now we can head on back this way. Out this door, and through this fiery looking alleyway here. What we want to do is, well first what I like to do is go this way. As I like to get rid of these guys first, because they're annoying. Especially these guys in the window. Okay. Ah, uh, the moss door's over there. Yeah, we can go in there, but first I want to clear out all these guys. Nice. One shot for him. Yeah, it could have been better. It's alright. As long as he's dead. Um... get rid of this guy. It's annoying because when you're trying to fight these guys, you'll probably end up backing up into these little fire patches here. Watch out for this guy. Alright, we need the blood key for these doors. Yeah, I got him. Got the guy here. Okay, and we'll have a fat guy right there. Now, we don't have to go this way just yet, but it's nice to get rid of these rocket launcher dudes. As soon as we can, yeah. Bunch of dolts blowing themselves up. Watch out for this guy, he can be a pain, because when he launches something off, uh, he can still kill you through this wall. It's so thin, the blast will get you. But what I do... Eek around slowly, and get him like that. That way he has no chance to get you. There'd be one, and there'd be two. So we'll come back here when we get our mutant key. Right now, we're all set and we have a couple secrets to grab. Okay, um... Let's go and clear out these rooms here. Actually, it might be... Well, I just want to get rid of... The main guy I really want to get rid of is this friggin' guy. Because I hate him so much. That guy. Before I go with the rest of that area, though... Uh, yeah, I want to go in here. And we find TNT boxes. So we grab the TNT... BJ can hold four TNT boxes. There's two secrets in this area. As we exit this room, we find ourselves on the other side of this fence.
All right, so what do we do with the TNT? Well, we gotta place them in the glass containers. So we'll go in here. Like these. So there's 16 of them that we need to do. Watch out for this friggin' guy. Yeah, those rocket launcher guys can really get annoying. Okay, there's three. And this guy's already dead. And there's four. First part is all set. Now we can head on through this moss door. And we find more TNT. With a blood key. Add another secret. Reload this. Come on. Open up there. Bit of him. And then, uh, well, we're going to have like three little guards out here. We can blow them up. That barrel. Sometimes someone survives. Uh, looks like we got them all. All right. That's cool. Watch out for the rocket launcher dudes. There's two of them. There's one. And there's two. Oh, let's get our old shotgun out. And here's two more boxes. Okay, be careful in this area. There's going to be another rocket launcher guy. I'll get rid of that guy. Right there. And place our four boxes on these glass containers. Alright, and um, you die. Now inside here, we're, well, we're going to have a really big freezer. Uh, of course, we need the horror key for that. That usually goes smoother. That's okay. All right, and then, um... Ah, yes, we have our blood key. We go through here, and we'll need the clippers to get through that. But right now, worry about the freaking rocket launcher guy. Uh, leave this door open so I can make a quick run in and run out. reload this. This guy is a bit extra deadly because there's not a whole lot of places you can dodge when you're out there, which is why I run in and out like that. See, it's like you get caught on the trees and stuff. Ah, clippers. All right. So we're good to go. Uh, we can cut our way through this thing. Right, and uh, inside here, uh, we don't really need to go into any of these rooms. They're really, uh, yeah, this is, I think there's like a rifle in this one. They're all connected too, so if you go in there, you can actually run right through. There's like holes in the wall. You can see it right there. I'm just going to grab that warm coat and get out. Um, now, we open this, oh, we need the, <laughs> we need the horror key. Of course we do. We get that, quickly cut through that. And here's the horror key. Whoa, that was not cool. All right, so when we go back this way, we go back this way, come on. And we open this door, we find this crazy looking freezer here. Now, I don't like to go in this way because, um, 
I actually think it's easier if you enter from the other side. I mean, you can run like hell to the other side and quickly grab the notebooks, but those things drain your your warm coat so fast that uh, I think it's just easier to get it from the other side. We will just do that. See? And there's the key, and then just to the left is that treasure. So if you're going for that 100%, I definitely suggest doing it this way. Because if you miss, if you are on the other side of the door and you try to grab those treasures, and if you miss, you're friggin' screwed because your warm coat is probably going to be, um... It's probably going to be, uh, friggin', um... Oh, there's one more. Yeah, see? But I have plenty of warm coat left. So I, I have no problem grabbing it now. Okay! We have all of our keys. What to do now? Um, actually, there's another secret, I think, that I did not get. Yeah, it's on the other side, I think. Yeah. Now that I'm thinking of it, I better go grab it. Is it... Here it is. I think that should be it for secrets, too. Let's check. Whoops. Well, not quite the button I wanted to use. Nope, there's one more secret. Oh, I know where it is. I know where it is. Um, let's reload this. I want to head back to where that hedge maze was. Ooh, don't stand too close. There's gonna be another chain gunner. He's gonna come from the right. Usually he doesn't die. I just give him a second to show up. Yeah, there he is. Now this area I don't think is very fair because it's all up to luck, really. Um, the sludge, there's no avoiding it. And... Uh, I just don't like this area. Uh, of course, the sledge has to be right where that secret is. Of course, here's a one-up. I don't know if he can take another hit. I think he can, but I really, really don't want to risk it. So I'm just going to grab that now. Really, uh, eesh. Well, trying to find the least resistance of sludge here. Um, there's the door we need to get. Oh, man, that sucks, dude. Ugh. Yeah, there's really no avoiding that. Not my favorite part. Not my favorite part at all. Uh, oh, yes. Yeah, I got that secret. So that must mean, yeah, I got everything. Okay. Just gotta get the last of the kills. Um, in here, there's just that rifle. Not really worth diving in there for that. Oh, I always forget that clown is over here. Yeah, that barrel room really drains the heck out of your health and use up a lot of your... Um, A lot of your friggin' um, portable med kits. Oh, I always forget he's there. There. Now we can collect the last of our TNT. This is the exit. No, I don't want to use that. Did I get him? I think I did.
Yeah, it's nice when you have distance from those friggin' um... From those friggin' uh, rocket launcher dudes. Go in here, set these explosives. Almost done. Uh, just gonna make sure I got all. Yeah, there's one there. Yeah, there's one more. Where is it? There it is. Yep, one more pain in the arse part. The friggin' rocket launcher dudes. And in here, there's one, there's two, there's three, and four makes sixteen. All right, cool. We're all set to go. Did I kill everything? Yes, I did. Um, let's see. I really wanted to exit this level with 100% health, like usual, but I don't think that's happening. Unless I use up my friggin', um med kits, or I could also go out and search for more, but... I really kind of want to just get out of this place. Yeah, we'll be okay. I think we'll be fine. Alright guys, that was Area 27 TNT. All done.